Hey guys, it's Kip here from KDC Marketing, and in today's video, I want to show you how you can add Google Maps to your Wix Studio website, and you can set it for multiple locations like this one, where you have all these uh, icons showing up here, or you can set it to a single location uh, like this one. So I want to show you how you can create these inside of Wix Studio, so let's get started. So to add this to your website, all you have to do is add a new section and then go to add element and then contacts and forms and underneath all these forms will be this Google Google Maps section and then you can just click this into your section so once I click this it's going to add it in and then you have a couple of different options so if you click manage locations you can have one location or multiple locations and then you can enter in the address the title description link and link text um, and then you do have some settings here. You can customize the zoom, how closely it's zoomed in or zoomed out. You can have it so that you can show map and satellite. The zoom control is over here. If you put this on, then it allows you to do the street view control. Um, this show directions link is going to be under your location you put in. And then the allow dragging is this full screen and dragging here. Um, so you can toggle all those on and off. The other cool thing is you can customize the design, so the map design itself. If you select one of these, this will become the new map design, and they have some uh, really cool options. They even have some satellite options down here at the bottom, or uh, these kind of options as well. So let's say that I select that one, so I can select that for my design. I can also uh, select the pin design uh, on this element. So. Uh, let me go back to the pin design here. So this will allow you to select a different icon if you want to use a different icon. Um, so you can do that. You can also add your own custom icon here. I like to just keep the default because it uh, shows really well um, with the contrast of these different maps. So, so yeah, it's pretty cool. And then I created this one that has multiple locations here and um, if I zoom out, I can see those. If I turn this to satellite, you can see where these different pins are. I can kind of drag around to see all the different locations. On this one, it's just one location, but still pretty cool. Um, can still do all the different things here that I, I could do. And then on this one, again, different style. So you can customize these however you want, um, and they work great for one location or multiple locations. And if you don't want it in your website, you just click delete on that section and it goes away and these work like regular elements um, so for example this section has some padding around it um, if I were to add padding to this section too it would work just like a regular section so it kind of hugs the container and then I could always customize that I can make make it so it doesn't stretch so you get a lot of the same features you would for regular elements so I hope you found this video helpful and one last time you just go over here to the add elements contacts and forms Google Maps to add these to your site and then you can customize them from there. So that's what I have for today's video and I will see you in the next video.